Hello everybody. Um it is 11 a.m. and it is August the 22nd. It's Thursday, 2024. Um and I just wanted to make another video because it dawned on me like that it's so completely obvious that these people are brain mapping because you know, it really, it doesn't make any sense because, like, okay, one minute, they're telling me that they're, uh, you know, um, I guess charging me with some horrible crime or something like that, which I'm not worried about because, A, I haven't committed a horrible crime, and B, I just, uh, well, 100% of the time, they're lying, so it really doesn't matter. Um, but B, <laughs> the most ridiculous part about all of this, and I remember that people that watch me specifically, you know, are watching because of information, um, you know, that I have, you know, or that I can explain the process in which this artificial telepathy happens. Um, and anyway, like, it, it's so funny because one minute they're like, oh, you know, we're charging you with this horrible crime and blah, blah, blah. And then the next minute they're like, just so you know, when you talk to such and such that, you know, they don't love you and, and, and all this other stuff. Bitch, what kind of detective, like, you guys are trying to come off like that that you have this information and this this inside information you know you you have to make it obvious that you're brain mapping and i don't give a i don't give a fuck if somebody likes me or if they love me or whatever and it's really none of your damn business anyway you know but the thing is is like, it's so, they, they expect to be taken seriously. Like, I really, like, 100% believe that this is military, you know, or at least at some point, you know, the military has grasped this and they are doing this. But, you know, I um, made a TikTok because I read, like, that you can tell if your cell phone is being tapped if you just stop paying the bill and your cell phone is still on like you still have service and no like no shit i have not paid a cell phone bill in over a year um you know i i, I switched companies like i had one company and then like it was just it was getting on my nerves and then so I switched to another company and I still have the cell service. So if you are talking on your phone and you just don't pay the bill and somehow you have, um, you still have service, um, you know, something is, a something is amiss. And I think that you have, if you, like, put in, like, star pound 020 or something like that, I'm not 100% sure what it is. But, um, that you can, uh, Google that, how you find if your phone, you know, if, if your calls are being forwarded or something like that, you can, it's, it's different for GSM and CDMA, um, it, it, some cell phones operate on a GSM radio wave. Other cell phones operate on a CDMA. Um, and you just, uh, most of the time, it's the difference in Apple and regular Android. But you will definitely need to do a search for your individual cell phone to find out what wavelengths that your cell phone service is on. But anyway, um, I highly recommend that you do that. I actually captured a screenshot where mine said call forwarding error. 
and then gave me a code and I took a screenshot of it. So, but the thing is, is you cannot find, if you call, they, they called it telco. Um, if you call your provider, they cannot tell you if your cell phone is, is being tapped or bugged. Um, so because it starts at another level, what they do is they, um, they clone your phone or, you know, they, like I said, they tap it and then they receive information and the, at the telco level, um, your carrier is being told not to turn your phone off under any circumstances. So, um, anyway, like I said, um, I, and I got that on Reddit. Like, uh, I just took screenshots of what people were saying and they're absolutely right. So, um, I did do a TikTok about that and I've gotten several views on it, but, uh, yeah, I do highly recommend that you do that, but, you know, when somebody's trying to pull off, you know, that, that this is a scientific process, you know, and, but then like, as soon as they get done saying something that like might be cause for concern or something like that, then they throw in some stupid shit, like, you know, feelings, because, like, you're, you're either technical or you're not, and what, once you prove yourself less than serious when you're talking about something technical and serious, then you, you're just considered a joke, a fallout from there, because you, you cannot have both, you know, you're trying to be taken seriously, you know, um, over the stuff that you say and like, you know, inside information, like you're telling me, you know, this dude, uh, you know, across town, what he's thinking and what he's feeling, you know, and then like, <laughs> you're going to try to like, blame me for something horrible that I know I didn't do, you know, which one is it? Which one is it? Do you want to be, be taken seriously? Like as someone that this is a serious situation and you need to get serious about it? Or are you a ball of emotions? And if you're crying this minute in the next five minutes, you'll be laughing you know, you're gonna have to pick a struggle because I don't know anybody that's respected like that. But anyway, it, you know, you're gonna have to pick. Do you want to be taken seriously or do you want to be looked at that you're emotionally and mentally unstable? You know, so anyway, but I didn't mean to make this video even this long, but I've got pink eye in case you guys can't tell i don't know what the hell happened with that but anyway i love you guys and check into that with your cell phones the code that you put in to find out if your phone has call forwarding or the information there are no hidden apps nothing like that they don't even need to go that far you you just you have to punch those numbers stop paying your cell bill and you'll know for sure Love you.